This is going to be a video review for my friend uh, of how to take YouTube videos and put them on your iPod. Uh, uh, this is my iPod is uh, an iPod is uh, right here you can see right here it's um, what is it? iPod Nano 3rd generation. Uh, I believe this works with any iPod that plays video really. Um, so yeah. So we're going to First, you need a tool to get the um, the videos off of YouTube. So for, we're gonna open a new tab here in Firefox, and we're gonna search for uh, save to PC. I'll put a link in the video description, so don't fret about having to find the right one. Just go over to the side, click more info or more see view more on the video description and I'll send it to uh, you here we're gonna go to download over here save to PC Lite save to Pro works even nicer because you can convert it right over to an mp4 file format right for uh, your iPod but since we're gonna do it the the cheap way which is free save to PC Lite is free uh, you're not gonna have to worry about that um, so first off, we're gonna have to download it, uh, the video onto the computer here. So we're just gonna go like that. Scanning for viruses. So we're gonna install it here. Oh, go away. Run. So yeah. Allow. Click next. I accept the agreement. Next, 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 and install. And we're gonna uncheck these because we don't want to do any of their visit their crap. Okay, so here we got this here. I think we see. Um, you see, if you are going to shut up, get out of here. If we were gonna do this in the pro version, which looks a little different than this, because I have pro on my other computer. We'd set it to MP4, but we can't for that. So uh, we're gonna put it as an MPEG. So when you're doing this, make sure you have it set. It'll be set to FLV, and you're not gonna want that because that's not gonna work. So set it to MPEG, or um, uh, you can't do it that way. So set it to MPEG, and that like that. All right, now we're gonna go get a video. Say we want this video. It's just a. I was listening to the song, so okay over here on the side we got this stuff. Um, so on my video right here, just click more info and then click that link over there for that thing. But anyways, uh, back if if you want this video on your iPod, we're gonna have to go over here and it says URL. Just highlight this whole thing. Copy. I suppose this would work up here too, but this is more accurate and this always works right there. Just paste that right there and click. Uh, da, 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 yeah, all right. Click save and start, and then you can see it's downloading the video right now. And there, and we're gonna need uh, an iPod uh, MP4 converter. So I'll be right back after this is done uh, converting and stuff. And yeah. All right. So now that we see that this video is being is done downloaded and it was saved to the documents file, it's 100% there. We'll just go make sure. Go in here. Go in here. Documents right here. Oh no, I don't want to name it. Let's see here. Okay, here it is, and we can open that with uh, Windows Media Player. Crap, I didn't want to do that. Did I? No. But it's gonna play it. As you can see here, it'll play it normally on your computer, but. This video wasn't actually a video, it was just a picture with some music on it. This probably wasn't the best example, but it is this video. It's the video, so. Right here it is. It won't go on your iPod. If you try adding it to iTunes, it won't work because it's not in MP4 format. So, we're going to put it to MP4 format. So, you need this guy right here, the Vidora iPod Converter. I'll put a link into where to download that. Just click that more, more show more on the description and 
click the Vidora, and then you'll get this initial setup when you open it for the first time. Just choose your one. I got the iPod Nano 3rd Gen. So, click that. That dude right there. Yeah. Alright. No, I think it's went right here because I minimized it before. Alright, um, so you want to get up here. After that, you click that thing, and you're going to want to get this screen here. Click the convert button here. Uh, da, da, da. Go to video file here, and it's gonna have this um, X Explore window up here. We're gonna want to go into Power Mode, Normal Modes. If you want to go into Normal Mode, it's probably a little easier, but it takes longer for me. And we're just gonna go into Power Mode, and then down here we're gonna select the file. So that's the one you converted, so or downloaded. So remember where you saved your uh, the save to PC saved file thing here. Remember where this is saved to. Um, so remember that, alright? Yeah. And it's saved in documents right here because it is uh, where to go. Hi. It's in here somewhere. Hold on one second. Alright, here it is. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, you gotta click all files. So, let me click the video we want here. And we're gonna select the output. Um, wherever it really works, so we're gonna put it in video, videos. And we're gonna call it, get rid of the YouTube, because then it gets so long. Flashing lights, device, and yeah, alright. And I believe that should be all good. And click start converting, then you click that start converting there. Now it says view uh, conversion in progress. We got more crappy ads. And we're going to see view conversion progress. And it's converting right now. And I'm going to pause it until it's done. Alright then, it's done. And we're just going to go back and check that the file's alright and good. We're going to go into here. We're going to go into videos where we saved it. And here it is. And it's an MPEG 4 file, which we want. So that's all good. Now what you want to go and do is uh, open up iTunes here. Make sure that your iPod is plugged in. Mine's called the Podular. We're going to go over to the Movies file here. And what do you know? It already added it. So if it's not there, click File. Whoops, File. Add File to Library. And make this a little bigger. I'm going to here. And we're going to go into Videos. And then you just click this. And since it's already there, and then it add it right there and then you'll be all good and now you just go into your iPod click your little device on your iPod and then in this thing here you're gonna wanna go over to movies tab up here and click this sync movies uh... yeah whatever and it's not gonna ask you that that's cause i'm using it for itunes and i'm not gonna really sync it cause that's gonna delete all my files and then you just wanna click um... if you wanna click all that's fine uh, make sure you just have this checked if you wanna click all it'll automatically check it and if you have more than one video it'll check all those and then you just click apply and it'll start syncing and then you're done and your videos will be placed under the you click in the main menu click videos and then click movies and they'll be under there I uh, hope that helped you guys, and yeah, have fun with it. Download any video you want from YouTube. I believe it also works with other sites, um, but YouTube has the most videos, so there you go. Hope that helped. Bye-bye. Good night, and Merry Christmas.